So, what's going on everybody? This is Joe. And Amy. And we are here with something new and different. Yeah. Amy, this game is called Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. Uh, with what this channel is, if you are new here, uh, we are taking Amy through video games that she has never seen before, which is basically all of them. <laughs> so, before we start, Amy, what, if anything, do you know about this game? Literal nothing, but it looks like that thing is rather sharp because it just went into rock. Oh, you should probably put your headphones on oh, there. Okay. That would be helpful. I'm sorry. No, that's my fault. I forgot to tell you before we went into They're this thing. Oh, I hear sounds. It's windy. Oh, is that what that is? I think so. It sounds like a, a creature groaning. <laughs> so let's look at our settings. Sure, everything looks great. I have no idea what you're looking at. That's fine. Okay. So you ready to get this thing started? I guess. I mean, I have no idea. Okay. Here we go. Oh. What the? Is that a guy coming out of a cauldron? Seems that way, huh? Uh, what the heck? Does this dude not have legs? <laughs> Is he stuck in that thing? Like what? <laughs> what are you... Is he trying to climb? Looks like it. But you're doing that. I am, yes. So why are you making him climb? Well, because he has to progress. How else is he going to get further along in this world? I, I have no idea. <laughs> I, I'm unfamiliar with how a man's torso in a cauldron <laughs> with a weird pickaxe is able to progress in any world. Uh, this is very weird. Whoa. No, that didn't work. Uh, that was closer. Why is there water? Where did the water come from? There's no from? feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. If you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black. If you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food on it. If you won an argument with a friend and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view. Starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. I'll be here. I, I'm very confused still. <laughs> It, is that voice supposed to be this man? Nope. Oh. Is he the narrator? Yes. Okay. Of this whole experience that we're having together. Is this an experience? Do you I, not feel that this is an experience so far? Um, it's a weird thing that I'm watching right now. <laughs> yes, that's correct. Um. Oh, boy. Don't do that. There's, there's water in the cauldron. So I will say for myself, I have never played this game before, but I have absolutely seen this game played because, you know, I, I consume YouTube content. And that was definitely a thing when this game first came out was uh, the fact that this game was played by many people. Uh, but I was, as I said, not one of those people. I recently uh, acquired this game. Is this the whole game? Like, why do people play this? <laughs> oh, is, God. Like, does it change? Does maybe change? he's a soup. Maybe somebody, maybe like, somebody caught him. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. Don't worry. I'll save your progress always, even your mistakes. <laughs> Gee, thanks. 
It's very kind of him. He's a very kind man. Um, okay, so maybe like somebody caught him, and they wanted to eat him, so they cut his legs off. Whoa, I do not this know This game is a homage works. to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B games. And B games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. No, 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 no. Come on. Uh, there we go. Woo. So okay. someone wanted to make him soup. They cut off his legs <laughs> and they stuck him in this cauldron <laughs> of water. Okay. And I guess he wandered away from the fire. <laughs> And now he's here? <laughs> With whatever this uh, pickaxe hammer looking thing is that he has. Yeah. Right? It's like a weird pickaxe that's really good uh, at uh, stabbing into rock. Mm -hmm. um, we haven't come across a ton of rocks yet. Is this yet. an outhouse? Is he going to the outhouse? Is he going to the bathroom? <laughs> How I mean, does it doesn't he go to the bathroom in that thing. I mean, who says it's water in there? I, oh. <laughs> no, I don't actually know that. Don't take that as fact. If he just sat in his own urine <laughs> for this long a period of time, I'm pretty sure his torso would just start deteriorating. <laughs> he hasn't been in here for this long. We we only just started. Oh, thank God! Yeah, baby. Perfect. Look at this. Look at us. We're doing things. We're getting stuff done here. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, okay. Now, how far can I extend this? Yeah, that's what I like to see. Thank you. What about now? Nope. Killer diaper rash. <laughs> Killer. That you we're just I love that you're manufacturing a whole story for this. I really appreciate that. <laughs> no, seriously, I do. it's great. It's really great. In a certain way, sexy hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B game. It's built nope. almost entirely out of nope. found and recycled parts. And it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. Hmm. I think we have to do this and go this way a bit. And then what if we try this? Yeah, that's what I like to see. Hell yeah. Okay. Is there something in the barrels? Uh, Maybe collect items. Uh, if you need to take a break, it's okay. I've saved your progress. Oh, no, okay, we got it. You don't oh. have to keep telling us that. <laughs> I think he's just assuming that people are going to have issues with this being very frustrating, and so they're going to well, need to take breaks along the way. I understand you know? that, but he's already said it. Like, I'm more frustrated by the fact that he's repeating himself. Oh. Okay. There's okay. a coffee up there. There is a cup of coffee up there. Or at least a, a, a takeaway hot cup. We do not know D technically what's in it. Does he need but... coffee to help him get through this? <laughs> does he need the caffeine? Do you need coffee to help us get through this? No, <laughs> no, I am not. Um, I'm not one for caffeine. That's fair. Uh, Sometimes in like, tea, but not yeah, always. I, I feel like he would get dehydrated rather quickly. Well, thankfully, he's got all that coffee. Thankfully, he's got all that water. Uh, well, yes, but he's not drinking it. He's in it. Yes. Um, so his skin is drinking it. Uh, yes. I mean, your skin does absorb a lot of liquid if mm -hmm. it's sitting in it. Um, of course. Oh, oh. God. Oh, uh, you just lost a lot of progress. <laughs> That's a deep frustration. <laughs> a real punch in the gut. It's mm. oh. fine. Okay. I mean, who's to say that that's even progress? <laughs> like, like, what is if if there's no objective? 
Well, is that progress anyway? Wow, very philosophical of you. I, I mean, is it? I would, <laughs> like, I mean, I would, it just seems like common sense to me. Well, I would argue that we've been progressing upward almost the entire time. Like towards the beginning, we came down into that valley that we just fell back into. Mm -hmm. And now we are only moving upwards. So presumably we are going up and only up at this point. Okay. The game is literally called Getting Over It, if you recall. Yeah. So. Oh, so you're supposed to get over the crap. Crap. the little mountain. Maybe. Also funny that you say little. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Little mountain. <laughs> well, we are rather little. Compared to the so mountain, sure. So if the mountain is little, then we're very little. Uh, so to us, perhaps it feels like a big mountain. <laughs> hey, I did it. All right, so now we need to... Uh, hold on. We got this. I will definitely keep people uh, abreast of my uh, mental state during this game. Like, <laughs> I, I am not one to um, become impatient, typically, or, uh, or get frustrated easily. Although, I guess, if you've watched our magic videos, maybe you would disagree. Because uh, there are occasions where, you know, I'll draw, like, a million lands and just get really upset. Um, but this in particular, I think... I think I'm going to be okay with this. Like, I, I just think it's funny. Like, you know, we lost all that progress. It's really not that relevant to me. Because I'm just having, here having a good time. Yeah. Um, I mean, for me, I get frustrated very easily. Fair. But um, I'm not the one controlling this. Right. And right. also, again, it, it, if I don't see losing progress in this game as <laughs> losing progress. Yeah, then of course. Then it's not really going to frustrate me. Come on. Go like this. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> that was bad. And uh, I'm not here, like, rooting for this guy. Like, I know <laughs> that his urine is going to rot his body. Ew. So, like, he's not going to make it. <laughs> you know? Um, so I'm not, like, trying to... <laughs> I'm not. I'm not trying to say like this guy. Oh my God! I hope he gets over this mountain. You know, like I. I don't really care what happens to him, because I know going in nope. that he's gonna pass away from all of the diaper rash. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrid. What you said. <laughs> It's awful. <laughs> this is awful what you're saying. I'm so sorry, everyone. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't apologize <laughs> to them. They, are, I'm sure, are appreciating. It's been a while since uh, playing this game was the thing to do. Uh, so I'm hoping everybody is enjoying. Obviously, we would love to hear your feedback on this in the comments. Uh, your feedback on the uh, lore that Amy has created for herself. <laughs> on this uh, game and in this story, uh, as well as my playability. You're more than welcome to, to leave that in the comments. Um, <laughs> yes. Okay, so we're almost back up to the barrels, which I believe is where we lost last time, or fell down last time, yeah. I should say. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, drink what's in the barrels. It's probably beer. <laughs> also something that's not going to hydrate you. I knocked over the coffee cup. Yep. But we made it up here. Oh, I picked back up the coffee cup. Definitely was my intention. Drink Don't worry. It. Drink it. Uh, uh, come on. Come on, you. Oh, boy. Oof. That's okay. We're okay. Slide down. Beautiful. Anyway, when you start okay. sexy hiking, you're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. It's dangerous. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them once you have the correct method or the correct equipment or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. Can we do this? I'm gonna get stuck on that part. So how do we conquer this Ooh. section? Beautiful. Good, because I was going to say, if you hit your head on that rock one more time, it's just going <laughs> to knock you out and you're going to fall. 
No, we got the cauldron. We'll be fine. <laughs> I didn't say <laughs> that you wouldn't be fine. The cauldron would keep us safe. I said you would safe. fall. <laughs> Nope, nope, nope. Come on. Nope. Oops. Now there's a chip in it. <laughs> See? Oh, was that not always there? Nope. Oh, interesting. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, we got there. Beautiful. Oh, God. Don't do that. Come on. Okay. Yeah, I gotta buy myself one of these. One of these what cauldrons? What a handy fucking tool. Or the hammer. The hammer. Yeah. Pickaxe thing. Oh, good lord. Look what we have to go next. A trash can, really? <laughs> yeah, don't you leave your trash cans on top of mountains like this? Yeah. That's where you leave them, right? Yeah. How else? All right, if here we I go. live in the mountain, yeah. This is This is a big deal. You ready? Yeah. Oh, oh no, that's fine. That's <laughs> fine. We got it. We got another chance. Oh god, that's fine. This is all fine. Stop it. I love the art in this game. You do? Yeah. Good. I'm glad. Yeah, like these rocks. Oh god. You can tell like that's fine. they're just fine. actual uh, pictures of actual rocks. It seems that like way. like the. Really uh, nice renderings, at least. Right. The the surface Oops. of these rocks is yeah. based okay. on actual rocks. You right. Know, it's, it's, it's a nice not, aesthetic. Right. It's, yeah. it's not a gray blob, you know? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, there's actual texture. The leaves on and... the trees are, look, you know, realistic. Oh, yeah. The, the, the moss and, and oh, 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 stuff oh, oh. growing on the rocks looks real. Oh, yeah. No! That's fine. Uh, let's see. What's the best way to get this done? Probably want to push ourselves over to here. And then while we're here, quickly... Uh, crap. Interesting. Okay. I like this stripey rock down here as well. Yeah. It's interesting because the rest of these rocks look like igneous type rocks mm. and that one's definitely sedimentary okay the, uh, <laughs> geology 100 percent not my strong suit <laughs> but uh i'm glad that you are appreciating the uh the scientific nature of the nature in this game i'm just saying like you wouldn't see that rock in this configuration with Correct. these other rocks Correct. that wouldn't be so it's a, not a scientifically accurate occurs. so it upsets you um, no, actually. I'm enjoying it. Okay. <laughs> uh, a little bit of variance, right? Yeah. All right, so we're pointed, actually, in this direction, so we might be able to... Uh, no, not really. No chance. Okay. That's fine. Thankfully, this area is not super punishing, where, like, I'm if I mess up, I'm still staying within this general area, hmm. which is nice. If I, if I went all the way back down to the bottom, that might frustrate me a little, just because this area is pretty hmm. difficult. Um... But otherwise, just trying to do this part over and over again. While possibly not as interesting for the viewers, apologies, uh, it is interesting for me to continue to try uh, and improve each and every time I do this. So if we go like this, and then like... Are we, at, are we like by <sighs> the sea? Is that what that sound is? Uh, there was a lighthouse in the background, so oh, yeah. yeah. was. Yeah. Oh god, that's fine. Oh god. Okay. Ah. Hoo hoo. Okay, what a jump. Uh, mm -hmm. I still feel like I should be able to go from here up to there, but it's not really working. So maybe I just. Ooh, interesting. Where are you trying ah. to get? Up. You're, you're trying to get to where that red oh, thing is. Obstacles yes. and safety hiking are unusual. Yes. And that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. No. The frustration is just essential no. to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. <laughs> I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get nope. past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them. 
And it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. That's kind of cute. You like this this conversation? I was hoping yeah. you would. I, so I, is I this think... guy a narrator? Or is he actually like the guy who made it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah he's yeah he's Bennett Foddy, which is the oh, getting over oh, with Bennett Foddy. Oh, okay. All right, you ready? Yeah. Oh. Nope, it's very slippery. Okay, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Very close. Three, two, one. Mm. Ah. Uh. Darn it. I guess you can't, like, change the direction that you're holding uh, the tool. Uh, how do you mean? Like, so that when you're swinging it a certain direction, <sighs> you can... Uh, no! Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> That's can, a tough one. When you're swinging it a certain direction, you can use the other side. Like, the more picky side than the hammery side. Uh, you can't do that, can you? You probably can. I have. I am not that skilled yet, um, but I sure am trying to be. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Hold oh. on. Like, wedged in here a bit, Ooh. but that's fine. That we should would have be been able to... awful for your elbow. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> okay, so I should be able to... Okay, sorry, trash can. Yes! Oh, there we go. You're gonna need to go back down anyway. Why? Because you need to go in that outhouse. It looks like it's gonna rain. <laughs> and that's the only shelter around? Yeah, that's the only one we've come across. Oh my god, <gasps> we did it. There's one up here. We though. did it. That's not an outhouse. That's a building, but it's not an outhouse. It's a shelter. Oh. Come on, come on. How? Okay. Let's plan this out strategically. Actually, that's not bad. Uh, okay. Can you extend your arms more? Maybe if I just do this. When you're building a video game world, nope. you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played Whoa. with. And in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Okay. Ooh, there you go. Oh god, come on. Ah. Uh, uh, don't do that. Yes. Yes, okay. Now, I feel like... I, f I genuinely feel like this is the way to go. I just think that maybe we need it a little bit lower. If I go like that... No. Or like, no. No. You need to like bounce. Yeah. Like well, that's what I tried to do your before. Arms is long. like bash it in, and then bounce up, and then do it again very quickly. Oh, uh, okay. I see what you mean. All right. So hold on. Let's do that. So you mean like. Oh. Yeah, you're going too horizontally. Yeah, I can see. Oh, come on, come on. Ah, crap. I hit the other <laughs> wall. <laughs> I clicked the mouse like that was going to do anything. <laughs> it was mostly accidental, but I tried. Come on, man. All right. Okay, here we go. Okay. I'm ready. Nice. You can do this. Oh, God. <laughs> well, that worked well. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, this was a great game. Uh... Actually, hold on. Okay, so what happens if I do this? Ready? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> ah, crap. It's not easy. Okay. Um... That's somewhat new. Okay. Can I lower myself onto this rock now? Not really. Kind of. So what if we... Uh, this is tough, man. This part's really tough. 
And you can't add tools. No. Because you can't get any. Correct. We're just in this cauldron. Um, oh god. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> Rectal insertion. Ew. Be one, Be one with the rock. Be one with the rock. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Then what? God. This is tough, I man. I don't know if you can do it that way. I don't know what other way to do it. It just it doesn't seem like there's an angle that works. Wow, really? Oh god. Okay, that's better. Nope. Okay. Is there a point where you lose the water in the cauldron and then it's less heavy and so it gives you less balance on these things? No. Is there a point when <laughs> The diaper rash is just so severe that you're just creating more water in the cauldron. Oh, you mean that? overflowing with your tears. That You've thing that you made up? Before. Yes. You know it's possible. Just do what you did the first time. That's not true. <laughs> I, I have not done this part before, and I do not know that it's possible, Bennett Foddy. <laughs> uh, oh, this might be interesting. Yeah, okay. Hold on. Because it looks like that's enough of a lip that I might be able to like catch it a little, you know? I think the problem is that it's a lip. Oh, crap. You have to go high enough above the lip so it sticks. Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, it's just very slippery in there. Yeah, this is tough. And is that back piece something you can hit? No, that is background. Nope. Okay. Uh. I mean, this rock here is going to be virtually nothing when we're done with it. <laughs> this little, like, yellow. I'm rock. super glad that that's not a, a mechanic. <laughs> that, like, it just dwindles away to nothing yeah. after a while. Yeah. Like if that's that's what would happen in real life yeah, if you exactly. kept trying to do this. Like yeah. it would, it would erode away <laughs> enough to a point where it would make it more difficult instead oh, of yeah. easier. Oh yeah. Okay. Come on. Yeah 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 yeah. Great. No problem. Let's just do this and this. Come on. Ugh. Beautiful. That's what I like to see. Okay. I can get back up there pretty quickly, which is nice. Um, nope. Stop that. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely the hardest part so far. Definitely the hardest part so far. Let's... No. 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 Damn it. I was afraid of that. No. <clears throat> oh, God. Uh. Yeah, this is tough, man. I, I'm not even... I feel like I'm not even making any progress anymore. Like, I felt like I was doing something for a bit, getting on this rock, and now I can't even get back on this rock anymore. That's It's because you better. wore it away. What? It's because you wore it away. Yes, that's definitely what it is. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Three, two, one. <gasps> that's better. Nice. Oh, thank God. Okay. 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 Come on. Come on. Do not know how I'm gonna do this. Oh, that was real good. Oh God, so stressful. 
<laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. You can do this. Are we ready? Yeah. Don't, don't mess this up, dude. Do not mess this up. I don't know who I'm talking to more, my character or myself. Okay. 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 I think they're kind of synonymous at this point. Seemingly. Nope. Okay. Uh, Already messed it up. But that is fine. We figured something out. These uh, these lights up here are very, very helpful. Yes. So when okay. we can get back to them, that will be... Well, what about the vine? You should grab onto the vine. Mm. Hook over the railing and go inside the house. Okay. I hadn't thought of that. Because the vine is not accessible from where we are. It's just a bit of uh, art for you to enjoy while you are banging your head against the wall with this part, I assume. Okay, so we can't quite make it up to there. Um, okay, come on. That's a little bit better. Come on. Perfect. No, not as perfect. Okay, and huh, nope. Better, I guess. Not better. Okay, now we're on the rock. Is there somebody in the house? No, there's not somebody in the house. <laughs> Bennett Foddy's in the house. He's going to come out and keep spouting philosophical stuff to us. And help us. And help us. No, that's definitely not going to happen. Oh, God damn it. Interesting. Okay. Come on. Wow. Don't do that. That's better. Oh, interesting. Okay. Can we do... No. He's splashing away. Yeah. All that water that you're so worried about. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hydration's important. Hydration is pretty darn important. <sighs> okay. Um, okay. Okay. We're here. We made it to the rock again. Up we go. <sighs> Let's try it. You ready? Yes. Yeah. <sighs> oh, cool. The, it, the walls are so narrow. No. <laughs> so narrow. Ah, I'm sorry, should I not laugh? No, you can laugh. Who cares? I told you, <laughs> I'm not upset. Like, if I start getting upset, I will let people know that I am upset. It's, like I said, this part is frustrating, but it's a challenge. This is the first, like, big challenge of this game in for me uh, so far has been this particular area. As you can rightfully tell. <sighs> That's rough. How do I do that? How do they get electrical all the way up here? Uh, this house. I mean, maybe the other side of the mountain is uh, more of a grade, or less <laughs> of a grade, I should say, less of a steep grade. Uh, and so they can, um, they have roads and stuff. And so why can't lines. we circle around the mountain? instead of climbing up this side. I mean, we started on the other side, and we're in this thing, so. And this is, as you can see, a two-dimensional world, so. Uh, it appears to be three-dimensional. Does it? Yes. Okay. I don't know where the third dimension <laughs> is, but I'll, I'll allow you to talk about it. That's fine. <laughs> Stop hitting your head. Thanks. Uh. I was definitely doing it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> really gonna suck if you get knocked out and you break your skull open and you have to bleed all over these rocks have to like it's a requirement oh man this reminds me of the time that i went herkimer diamond mining with a friend of mine okay and uh <laughs> i busted my hand so bad with the pickaxe did you <laughs> yeah um just by like wow hitting the rock somewhat near my hand <laughs> it busted my hand somehow i don't even know how and uh i was just like well we're kind of stuck here like it's gonna be a while before we can go back to the cabin and see if they have a bathroom so i just let it bleed and it Gross. and it kind of formed this very sort of gelatinous um 
like pseudo scab of Gross. blood that just kind of stayed there and kept it from uh, bleeding. You know, it clotted in such a way that it was able to, um, you know, stop the bleeding. And uh, then when I went back down to the um, the cabin and I went and washed my hands, I, I had to tear that gelatinous uh, clot right off. Okay. <laughs> it, it hurt very much. Wow. <laughs> well, I hope people who were squeamish coming to watch getting over it with Bennett Foddy uh, weren't s- <laughs> blindsided by Amy's lovely, lovely story. Uh, yeah, so, um, that's that's what this game is reminding me of. It's, it was a, a great time. Um, I wound up with a lot of um, Herkimer diamonds. Uh, they can't see you doing air quotes, but I can tell them that you're doing air quotes. Yeah, I was doing air quotes <laughs> because um, they they were um, they were big pieces of rock that maybe had Herkimer diamonds in them, kind of. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really know what ever happened to those. Oh, good. Um, I did save them. I think. Thank God. Well, (laughs) I made it up to the lights a second time. And so that is probably an indication that I can do it. We know I can. I got all the way to the top of this general area and we should be able to move on further. But for now, that is going to be the end of this particular episode. Next time, hopefully you can hear more about Amy's Herkimer diamond mining, but also... <laughs> I, there is no more to that story. <laughs> well, then I guess not. Uh, but we can hopefully progress further. That's kind of the idea. Uh, hopefully you all enjoyed. Please leave your thoughts down in the comments below. Did you see this game when it was played by literally everybody on YouTube? Not literally. I'm using literally incorrectly there. Uh, but a lot of very popular people on YouTube who do gaming videos. Uh, or did you not? Is this the first time that you're seeing it? Have you played this game? Have you beaten it? Uh, do you hate it? Do you love it? Anything? Have you gone Herkimer Diamond Mining? There you go. The there you go. Anything and everything. <laughs> Were you grossed out by Amy's story? Uh, <laughs> Let us know in the comments below. Thank you all so very much for watching. Like I said, I really hope that you enjoyed. Commenting down below, like I said, liking the video, subscribing to the channel, uh, ringing the bell for notifications, checking out our other channels, all that fun YouTube stuff is something that we would really appreciate if you could do. And we hope that you enjoy out there. But for now, from us here at the Geek For All family of channels, I have been Joe. And I'm Amy. And as we always say, in whichever video of ours you watch next, we will see you all next time. Thanks, everybody.